Hi, I'm Shelly with Gilbert Marketplace. I wanted to show you some cute tassels I made at Christmas time. And they're good for any time of the year. I made this one at the holiday times and super cute. I used um, buffalo checkered fabric and I just made some Valentine ones. They're cute for gifts, presents, you can decorate your house, put them all over, whatnot. So I'm going to show you how I made those tassels. Nice and simple, and we're going to go from there. Um, what you're going to need is some three millimeter wood beads. Jesus, sorry about that. <laughs> um, you're going to need um, a red bead, and I just got that from um, Garland. And you'll need a ruler and ribbons. I did get all these ribbons at um, the dollar store, and you're just going to get an assortment of ribbons. Today, I have um, a red buffalo checker, a black and white buffalo checker, some pom pom little ribbon, this cute little burlap and heart ribbon, some red see through like organza, and a couple of Valentine heart looking ribbons. Okay, so we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven different ribbons, and then um, twine. What I did with this is I just took all of my ribbons and I made them 12 inches and I cut them. So, you know, it's just a simple ruler, lay them on top and give it a snip. Um, this will help make your um, tassel a little bit fuller. So I used white because it matches and I just went back and forth and I did that like a dozen times just to get some uh, fullness in my uh, tassel. So we're going to just get that. Choo choo. Alright. I think that's 12 times if I'm counting correctly. If not a little extra, we'll just make it full. Alright. Uh, I'm just gonna cut the ends and cut the ends. Nice, real easy. Okay, and so you can just kind of place them on top of each other, stacking them any um, particular way. But I'm gonna put the white there and put the red, black, and white, some tassel. Hopefully, you guys are all seeing this one. Uh, all the comments are on there. It's hard to see if I can see it. And we're going to stack them all up. It's that simple. Stack them up, okay? Take your uh, jute or twine, cut a decent, um, you know, piece, probably a good 12 inches is probably good. Find your center point of your ribbon. And a lot of times I just leave my ruler right here so I can see six inches obviously would be half. And then we're going to make a simple knot Nothing fancy. Pull it super, super tight. Just like that. Nice and tight. Double knot it. And maybe a little triple knot. Hey, what the heck? Can't hurt. Okay. And so that's, you know, we've got our tassel going there. Then I take both of my um, ends. I'm just going to cut that because that's going to be really long. And I kind of cut it with a little bit of a point. And the reason for that is, is I'm going to feed this through the wood ball. And then just put one. We're going to put our red bead. Do the same. Just kind of shove that through. Sometimes it's a little tricky, but you'll get it through there. Alright, let's twist that real good. And it is playing difficult. A little extra twist in there. Okay, it's coming now. Ay, ay, ay. Except one came and not the other, so that's not good. It's easier to do them both at the same time. So I'm going to just pull it back off. 
because if you do them um, at different, uh, if you do them separate, you'll never get it to feed through. And just give it like a good twist. This is like the trickiest part. There, I think we got it this time. There we go. Put the red and then one more white. And these I just left natural. You can paint them or whatnot, but I kind of, I like that natural wood look. Okay, so that's, we're doing pretty good there. Now, what I do is I do a couple knots right there too, just so our beads don't fall off and aren't dangling around. Just you wanna make sure that you knot it two or three times to make sure it's bigger than the um, bead so it doesn't slide through. And then you can pull this, make another knot, and that will be like the way you'll hang it. And that is that simple. So the, like I said, I made a couple different tassels. You can add them to your decorations, packages, bookmarks out of them. They're just kind of fun. I mean, it's that simple, ladies. Hey everyone, it's Shelly again with Market Gilbert Marketplace. <laughs> you can tell I normally do these in the morning. I'm tired. Um, it's Shelly with Gilbert Marketplace. You guys all have a great night. Good luck.